Hey there, Sleeping Eevee family. Welcome back to the channel. We are opening up a booster box of Stellar Crown, finally. I'm so excited. I actually got this booster box from Geeked Orlando. Uh, it was sent over by Geeked Orlando, also Nanapoke, but uh, just a thank you they sent me <laughs> from Geeked Orlando. I'll show you guys what's in here too. Looks like they sent me something else. Ooh, Grand Tree. I like this A spec. It looks really, really pretty. <laughs> One of like two stadium A specs that they came out with. So that's really cool. Thank you so much. That's an awesome <laughs> addition I did not expect. But Geeked Orlando, I will have their Twitter handle popped up on the screen. And I will also put a link to their profile down in the comments. Oh, and I will also put a link to their website. I don't think their online site is up just yet, but I know it's coming soon. So <laughs> I'm super excited to open this. This is gonna be a two-parter. We wanna really enjoy the cards with this. So today we're actually gonna go do the left side of this booster box. <laughs> and then you guys will have to come back for the next video to see the right side. So, but thank you so much Geek Orlando for sending this to me. I will say I did, I did buy this, <laughs> but I do appreciate them sending it to me. Um, they are amazing. They're still a fairly new card shop, so if you guys are in the Orlando area, go check them out. <laughs> go check them out. All right, so let's pop this there and go to packs. I'm usually never good at putting these in, but I think I got it this time. I love the cinders up top. <laughs> Look at that. And we will put this to the side. Booster box to the side, and we'll have this little, uh, see if we can't. Well, let's stay right there. There we go. Well, it blocks what I wanted to show you guys. Uh, we'll see if it'll sit right there for a minute. Not really. Grr. I'm just trying to, there we go, there we go. <laughs> I know, a lot of effort. So we're just gonna do this left side today. <laughs> I was trying to just make sure you guys could see the geeked part. So let's get into it. And we are gonna slow roll some of these cards. We are gonna see uh, if uh, some of these playable ones, we'll read some of them. But let's see what we get in here. Okay, this Merle is new. Some of this artwork I haven't seen. Like Gossip Floor, I haven't seen that one. <laughs> I've opened up quite a few packs, but I still haven't seen all the artwork here. This Comfy is adorable. And we have like, I think this week in Pokemon Sleep, because I see the Comfy and it just immediately reminds me of that, is uh, I think Pokemon Sleep style Discovery. So there might, I think there's a new area opening up soon. Papaya Berry. We have looked at, I think it was the Aka Berry before. We may have looked at this one, but you take 60 less, less damage if you have this attached to your uh, uh, Pokemon. And if your Pokemon, your opponent's Pokemon is psychic, you take 60 less damage. So we got a Tornadus, Chinchow, into a Cradley. So <laughs> there we go. We're going to look at some of the items. Like I always like doing that and uh, look at some the stadiums, which I think I've mentioned one before, the Area Zero one. We'll stop and look at some of the cards, so. <laughs> I always like looking at some of the playable ones. The item ones or cards that really just seem playable, some of the ones that have abilities I like to stop at, so. But we got a nice Lapras here, and I've been seeing information about TCG Pocket, and I'm getting really excited for it. I know it's just supposed to be a fun game. Not really a uh, Super competitive, so I, I look forward to that. We got Slowpoke, Gravity and Gemstone. As long as this Pokemon, the Pokemon this card is attached to is in the active spot, the retreat cost of both active Pokemon is uh, one more. And Caracosta, Primal Knowledge. Attacks used by your Pokemon do 30 more damage to your opponent's active evolution Pokemon. Okay, that's not bad. It's a nice bench setter. Um, it also doesn't say it doesn't stack, so 
It may stack if you actually have more than one Caracosta, if you decide to use that in your deck. So it's nice if and it's to your opponent's active evolution. So mm, that's a maybe playable. So, but we got an Eevee. Of course, Eevee's call for family. Search your deck for a basic Pokemon and put it on your bench. There's always some version of this for an Eevee. Uh, there's some Eevees that are really good, like the one that's for 151. You could pull three different type of Pokemon and put them into your hand. There's also the Eevee from Twilight Masquerade with Ascension. You find a Pokemon, one of the evolutions it evolves into, and you put it on that Pokemon. So the Eevees are generally pretty good. Uh, <laughs> they always end up having like maybe that and a, a, one attack. So we got our Reshiram, but I actually do use evolutions in a couple of decks that um, Mudkipper and I have made. Eldegoss, Meryl, into a Ledian. So the Ledian was used in pre-release, but when you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve your Pokemon during your turn, you may switch in one of your opponent's bench Pokemon that is 90 HP or less remaining in the active spot. So, if they retreat in one of their Pokemon that has not much health left, and you have the Lydian, you can swap it back in and get that and get that knockout. <laughs> uh, again, it's one of those, I'm not sure how you'll see the how much play to it. So we got this Lechonk, but I'm very interested. We got Drifblim. Payapa Berry, Reshiram, Hoot Hoot, Grimmsnarl into a Clean Clang, Emergency Rotation. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is in your hand and your opponent has any Stage 2 Pokemon, po Pokemon in play, you may put this Pokemon onto your bench. Okay. Alright. So I guess if they're using a Stage 2, I'm trying to think of what popular Stage 2 you could use at the moment. I guess Charizard. <laughs> uh, Charizard comes to mind. I guess if they're using Charizard, you can just put that right onto your bench. So, but I guess it's, eh. I just don't see when you use that one. We got a Frogadier, Coridon, Slowking, Veluza, into a Hydrapple EX. Okay. I really like Hydrapple. It's super, I, I really like Hydrapple and uh, Appleton. I'm not the biggest fan of Flapple. <laughs> I just think it's kind of odd, but I do like the other two. Ripening Charge. Once during your turn, you may attach a basic grass energy from your hand to one of your Pokemon. If you attach energy to a Pokemon this way, heal 30 damage from that Pokemon. Okay. I actually see that tying him with uh, Ogre Pond pretty well. So, if you, it's from your hand to one of your Pokemon, Ogre Pond, you already can has it already has an ability. She she can uh, attach a grass energy from your hand to her, and you get to draw a card. So I guess if you're able to attach one, you get to heal 30 damage if you have damage on your Ogre Pond. So kind of pairs a little bit. Perugly, Score Bunny, Briar. Okay, actually, funny enough, just traded for this one, but that is okay. I actually see some. Excellent quality control here. That is some rough top to this briar. So, <laughs> but we pulled a full art trainer. I am already anticipating some dupes. I have been pretty good about, I've been really hitting it hard on this set. And so I've been actually been able to train some of my uh, older Scarlet Violet cards. Ones from Shroud of Fable and the older, earlier sets. I shouldn't say older, but earlier sets for uh, some stellar crown cards, so. <laughs> I've been hitting it hard. <laughs> so, and I may just be opening the one booster box. We will have to see, we will have to see. Crydon, Lacy into a Dreadnought. Prevent all damage done to this Pokemon attacks from your opponent's Pokemon if the damage is 200 or more. That's quite a few Pokemon that can do that, so. We do have Lacy as well, and I find another Lacey, I'll stop at that one. But uh, the Dragon is kind of cool. It's a nice one prizer if you're just doing a one prizer deck, so. But we got Briar. I didn't even stop to look at her. 
We got just solid quality control cards on there. We got another EV. And I don't think there's actually a Pokemon that Eevee can evolve into that's in the set. Like, I don't think there's a Sylveon. Lilip! All right, we got a Lilip illustration rare. <laughs> this one's a really pretty, pretty one. There's one that I'm actually really seeking out, and we will sleeve this one up. I love the illustration rares. I just, I just do. This one's awesome. <laughs> And of course, you need the fossil to evolve into it. And uh, during your opponent's next turn, the defending Pokemon can't retreat. But look at this awesome just artwork. I love it so much. I feel like this is gonna be one of those underrated ones that is just not gonna get enough attention. I do have my sights set on one. There's actually one illustration where I'm really seeking out. And uh, we pull it. I'll be able to uh, show you guys what it is. So, um, real quick with the Briar, you can only use this card only if your opponent has exactly two prize cards remaining. During this turn, if your opponent's active Pokemon is knocked out by damage from attacks used by your Terra Pokemon, take one more prize card. So, you could potentially take three. Again, some that's not bad of a trainer. I don't see her being used too much unless. Uh, you absolutely want her in there because it's only situational. Marowak, Raboot, into a Bouffalant. Now, the Bouffalant only works, you take 60 less damage, only if you have another Bouffalant in play. Only if you have another one, so. <laughs> um, but it was actually a good pre-release one, I think. Some of them, are, I think, are really good for pre-release cards, like Briar was very good for pre-release. We got a root fossil there. <laughs> Veluza, Reverum, Espathra, Arcaladon. All of your Pokemon that have steel energy attached to them have no retreat costs. Again, not bad. Wide Wall. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, whenever your opponent plays a supporter card from their hand, prevent all effects of that card done to all your Pokemon. Okay. Okie dokie. Hmm, I guess if, hmm, I'm trying to think of one. I think maybe Rhyme would qualify for that. So Rhyme forces your opponent to switch out so it wouldn't affect that Pokemon. So I think that's what it means. I, that's the best example I can think of. Area Zero Under Deaths. This is the one that would be very playable for any Terra Pokemon. It doesn't have to be the Stellar Terra, <laughs> any Terra Pokemon. That means you can have up to eight Pokemon on your bench. And then if you don't have a Terra Pokemon or this stadium gets discarded, you have to discard Pokemon until you have five. <laughs> and whoever played it has to discard first. So we got Rapidash, Cradley, Reshiram into a Raging Bolt. Okay which there is a Best Buy promo card of that Raging Bolt if you guys have not yet gotten one. And there's also of that Arcaladon, there's a GameStop one. So <laughs> uh, check your stores if you can. I know the Best Buy one you can also order online. We have Azumarill, Area Zero Underdeps, Talonflame, Dreadnought into a Grimmsnarl. I actually almost made a mistake with that Grimmsnarl. I was going to put it into my pre-release deck, but I realized at the last second, I was glad I checked it. Uh, I kept thinking it was a stage one. It's, it's a stage two. I didn't have an Infidim. I had the Morgram, but I didn't have an Infidim, so there was no way I could have played it. So, Into the next pack, I will pull out the rest of the ones on the left side because I know we're getting down in the uh, box. We got Slowking, Cubone, Slandit, into a Blastoise EX. Look at that one. And this one is similar to the 151. It has the same effect. This Pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks. And then the Twin Cannons. So different artwork, same attack. And I believe the Venusaur is the same way. So if we do see the Venusaur, it's the same way. Just a different artwork. I want to say that those came from a specialty deck, They're probably in Japan, and so they just wanted to put them into a set. So, 
One, two, three, four. Looks like we have five packs left in this side. I thought there were a few more. <laughs> but box goes by quick when you're having fun. So far, we've gotten four pulls and a bunch of EVs, so and a couple of EVs, I should say. Which means that right side might be loaded, but you guys will have to stay tuned for it. We got glass trumpet, and choose up to two of your benched colorless Pokemon and attach a basic energy from your discard pile to each of them. You can only play it if you have any Terra Pokemon in play. So this pairs well with the Terrapago, so I would think. Reverse Hollow Eevee. Electivire into an Iron Boulder. Okay. I'm actually quite surprised we only have four. <laughs> I kind of was expecting at least a couple more at this point. So, and we still don't remember there's usually two A specs too. Uh, the A spec that Geek sent me is, is a outside the box. <laughs> I'll say the outside the box. We got Deonsi, Slow King, Akaberry. Sparkling Crystal. I have pulled this one a few times. Into a Meltan and a Noctowl. Noctowl? I think we looked at the promo on that one. So it is the same. I actually like the artwork though on the regular card. It looks really cool. But we got the Sparkling Crystal, which again pairs pretty well with Terra Pokemon. But I actually don't see too many people wanting to get it. So again, there are other better uh other a specs that are a lot more uh worth putting in there because you can only have one a spec in your deck so they may not want to put that sparkling crystal in there instead just go for uh prime catcher a hero's cape um master ball one of those probably prime catcher i think it's the most plain one but let's see i love this mo rotom <laughs> another ev put over there in my ev collection Kofu, put two cards from your hand on the bottom of your deck in any order. If you do so, draw four cards. <laughs> you can't use it if you only if you don't have two cards in your hand. And ooh, I love this one, La Lapras EX. We've pulled the full art, and Mudcube has pulled the full art. Now we have pulled the regular one. I like how in these stellar, the terras, the stellar terras. They have the rainbow borders. It looks super, super glittery. I love that. And we got Power Splash. Does 40 damage for each energy attached to this Pokemon. And then you got Larimar Rain. Larimar Rain. I know I'm absolutely butchering that. Look at the top 20 cards of your deck. Dang. And attach any number of energy cards you find there to your Pokemon any way you like. Shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Dang, <laughs> that's definitely a pretty powered up Lapras there. I definitely see how good that one can be if you're gonna play a water deck. Um, yeah, you just need like the Psychic and Steel, which honestly, I always say this, you honestly don't even need to run like the other energies. All you need is your Luminous energy. So to me, you just need to put two of the types of energies like water and psychic or water and steel and throw that luminous energy in there. You can have up to four luminous energy and I'll just act as the other one. So I, I, <laughs> I cannot push luminous energy enough. I use it a lot. I don't understand why people use it more. I know it's not a basic one, it's a special one, but er. <laughs> we got Glamiao into a clean clay. Oh my goodness, I used it in a lot of the ones I've built. But hey, these last few packs have really stepped it up on this side. So, let's see. This is our last pack on the left side, so we are going to put one to the front and boop Eevee and Mudkip, since I'm in the reverse spot today. I was putting Mudkip next to the Swampert's. We got Ladyba, Minfu, Cubone, Nimble, Luminion, Rapidash, Vicavolt, Celebi, Mail Battle, into an Arcaladon. No last pack magic, but we still have the other half of this booster box to go, so you guys will have to come back <laughs> and watch the right side and honestly see if uh, we can get a few more hits. Because so far we got six, we got two EXs, 
uh, three AXs, my bad, a full art illustration and an A spec. So I'm expecting that right said have more. So uh, again, stay tuned. <laughs> that the other side, I mean, you guys are just gonna see. I'm actually pretty curious myself, but uh, <laughs> until the next one, we got this other side, guys. We got this other side. <laughs> Take care, sleep well, and good night.